In this video, we'll show you how to install an Oracode 480i wireless lock. To install the strike on a wood frame, only use the strike plate, reinforcing plate, dust box, and screws supplied. Installing the strike on a steel frame is very similar. Only use the strike plate, dust box, and screws supplied. Let's start by preparing the door and determining which template fits your 460 lock installation. Use either the 2 and 3 8 60 mm or 2 and 3 quarters 70 mm back set. With the appropriate template, mark and drill the holes. The 1 inch 25 mm hole is on the center line of the door thickness. Mortise the door edge for the deadbolt faceplate. The deadbolt is preset as 2 and 3 quarter inch, 70 millimeter, backset. If required, adjust the deadbolt to 2 and 3 eighths inch, 60 millimeter, backset. Install the deadbolt in the door with the two screws. Make sure the slot is at the bottom and the tape is still over the deadbolt. If the cylinder is not already assembled in the lock, proceed as follows. First, remove the four screws from the back plate. If necessary, loosen the post to remove the back plate and continue by removing the back plate from the rear of the lock and install the key cylinder. When reinstalling the back plate, make sure that the wires will not be pinched. If required, retighten the post while making sure not to pinch the retaining ring. Reassemble the back plate with the four screws. To adjust the lock handing on the outside housing assembly, make sure the ring opening is farthest from the slot. For right hand, the groove will be at the 6 o'clock position. To adjust the lock handing to left hand, Rotate the outside ring so that the groove is at the 12 o'clock position. Make sure that the inner ring doesn't rotate. To assemble the tailpiece, click it in place. Next, remove the inside cover by unscrewing a single screw and pulling off the cover. To assemble the outside housing, place the gasket onto the housing and insert the housing into the door. Make sure to insert the cable through the door. Ensure the tailpiece fits through the slot on the bottom of the deadbolt. Remove the tape from the deadbolt. To install the inside trim assembly, route the cable through the assembly. Next, if the door thickness is between 1 and 3 8 inch and 1 and 11 16 Install the two short 8x32 screws with lock washers. If the door thickness is between 1 and 11 16 and 2 inches, install two long 8x32 screws and lock washers. Additionally, if the door thickness is between 1 and 3 8 and 1 and 11 16 inches, install two short 6x32 screws. If the door thickness is between 1 and 11 16 and 2 inches, install two long 6x32 screws. And finally, install a short 12x24 screw with a lock washer if the door thickness is less than or equal to 1 and 3 quarter inch. Install a long 12x24 screw with a lock washer if the door thickness is greater than 1 and 3 quarter inch. Be certain to tighten all these screws very well. Next, connect the wireless antenna cables together. Then, connect the power cables. Finally, insert three AA batteries. Install the inside cover and tighten the single screw at the top. With the door open, 
Verify the operation of the lock. This concludes the installation process for the Oracode 480i wireless lock. For customer service, contact Kaba Lodging.